Good morning again, everyone. Um, wanted to kind of get things started here with the ConfTel webinar. Again, my name is Joe Labella, uh, Advanced Solutions Practice Director here with 888 VoIP. We will also be joined by Peter Gasparo from ConfTel. He's a sales director here for the U.S. And we want to make sure to obviously introduce, you know, both 888 VoIP and ConfTel. Um, but really, we're going to get a really nice deep dive of the ComTel products, the portfolio, you know, some of the ins and outs of installation, as well as the you know physical components of some of these bundles. But um, you know, I uh, I know it's still early in the morning, so again, thank you all for attending and, and hopping on and spending some time with us today. Um, at some point, we're going to have you know Peter take over and kind of go through everything. But just wanted to do a quick uh, introduction for anyone who isn't familiar with who 888 VoIP is. Uh, we are a hardware distribution partner uh, with some of the leading brands in you know the technology field. Uh, Comtel is one of the newer manufacturers that we've been working with. Uh, we've been really seeing some really good traction with conversation and you know just familiarity with the type of technology that Comtel has. But as your you know trusted hardware IT distribution partner, we want to make sure that you know where to come uh, for any Comtel questions, any pricing and availabilities, solution architectures, you know rollouts and builds of different opportunities that you're working on. So again, feel free to jot down my email address. We'll uh, we'll make sure to get some other information towards the end of the webinar. But always make sure you know to come to us. We can get Peter and his team involved if needed. Uh, but we do want to make sure that you've got multiple avenues to reach out for any of the console questions that you have. Um, so yeah, so with um, I guess with that, I will you know pass everything over to Peter to get started with some of the background on Comptel and their product line, and just see what other questions we can answer throughout the webinar here. Perfect. Thank you, Joe. Thanks for thanks for everyone taking out their time uh, to sit down with us and, and chat a little bit about Comptel and who we are. Throughout this presentation, if you have any questions, there is a questions poll. Um, in your dashboard, feel free to ask any questions. We may hold all questions till the end, but if one does pop up during something I am talking about and, and we see it, you know, we will uh, we will get that answered for you. We are also going to be giving away four personal video kits. Um, we will email the winners of those after the webinar, but we will um, talk a little bit about the Comptel portfolio. I'm gonna talk about some promotions. I'm gonna talk about some case studies that we've done and just give you a deep dive into who we are at, at Comptel. First and foremost, we are a Swedish based company. We're founded in 1988, so a 30 plus year old company. We have a very strong US presence here. We're in over 60 different countries. We've won a number of leadership awards from Frost and Sullivan that puts us up against some of our competitors. Um, we do have, you know, Omni Sound Technology, which does filter out a lot of the background noise. It is our patented Omni Sound Technology, so you're not going to hear the air conditioner fan, the tapping of a pencil, anything along those lines. We are an audio company first and foremost, but we've recently added video into our portfolio. And especially during COVID, more and more companies are coming to us to look for an agnostic solution and something that is going to work with not only zoom but teams but webex but you know google meet blue jeans whatever it is we work with all major platforms on our devices but we're also the leader in personal conferencing devices as well as conference equipment conference phones speaker phones things like that so we're going to talk a little bit about that throughout the presentation again we have won a number of awards through frost and sullivan in regards to the customer value leadership award we've won the product leadership award we've won a number of design awards on our devices um, here at comptel very broad portfolio so we like to say no size fits all it really depends on the number of people the size of the room really dependent on what's the right solution for your business and your customer's business. The portfolio we're gonna to have to talk about today is I'm gonna talk about a little bit of everything that Comptel has to offer, but most importantly, our audio and video solutions and what's happening right now in the US um, in regards to COVID and hybrid work workspaces and also that work from anywhere solution. We have a number of different connectivity options, whether it's a wireless analog, wireless SIP solution, we have an analog wired solution, an IP or SIP enabled solution, 
We have Bluetooth enabled solutions and also three uh, USB enabled solutions as well. We cover every single end endpoint. So if you're working from home in an office, if you're if you have a cubicle space, all the way up to the extra large boardroom, we've even outfitted a number of auditorium sized conference rooms or multi-purpose rooms as more and more people are starting to call them. One thing we have on our website that's available at confdel.com is our interactive room guide. And what our interactive room guide does is just gives you a cross cut of a traditional office. What are some of the different conference rooms that people are seeing? And what we've done is we've actually dug into those offices and given you recommendations based on the size of the room, the number of people, and what you're trying to do. So with this interactive room guide, you are able to click into the office of choice. And everyone has probably seen an office like this, which is an executive boardroom office. They're gonna have your executive desk, but then they always have that little four or six person tabletop. And what our interactive room guide will do is actually give you a recommendation of the proper speaker, the proper microphone, and the proper camera. Right there for your executive office, your work from home office, your cubicle space, personal video kit, which is again, one of the four devices we'll be giving away today. Personal speaker phone, personal camera. You click on the show setup button, you are gonna be able to see the cabling, see how it needs to be configured, see how it needs to be run. And you're also gonna have some part numbers available on this. We can show you bigger conference rooms as well. So if you're looking for an extra large boardroom, this is actually how Harvard University has set up their conference room in a U-shaped table with the three Conftel 800s daisy chain together and we'll talk a little bit about the portfolio and again the solutions that we have to offer here at Comptel. That is our interactive room guide. It is available on our website. Our first device and our flagship phone, our most popular device is our 300WX. This device has replaced the SoundStation 2W if you're familiar with that Polycom device. This device is wireless analog, wireless SIP. There are two different base studies. It's the uh, uh, deck base stations, the phone is the same itself. So depending on if you have an analog phone system or a VoIP phone system, just determines what base you need to go with. It has a 60 hour battery life talk time, 180 standby time. A good case study for this solution is WeWork. WeWork is one of our largest customers. They have over 10,000 of these units in their shared office spaces worldwide. USB port for video integration. It has an SD card for call recording functionality. It does have a replaceable battery. At Comptel, we offer a two-year warranty over the full portfolio, one year on the battery. But this device, again, is our flagship phone and our most popular solution. Very popular for a lot of school administration buildings. Um, Clark County School District, Newark School District, they have over 300 of these units for the SD portion of the recording functionality. They wanna be able to record any and all conversations that are happening with a student and a teacher or a, a superintendent and an interview candidate. They can record any and, all any and all conversations with this device, whether it's on a phone call or not. That is the 300WX, again, our flagship phone. What's nice is it's sold in three different variants. It's sold without a base, for the USB video functionality. It's sold with an IP base, and it's also sold with an analog base. We sell it without a base as well for this reason right here. You can connect five phones to every one IP base within a 250, 300, and 300 foot range. It is a deck connection, so it is a secure connection, but it will wirelessly communicate with that phone and connect um, back to your network wirelessly and give you that flexibility and portability to be able to pick this up and walk it from conference room A to conference room B or back into the executive office if you need to do a, a conference call with a number of people. Designed for up to 20 people. Also expansion microphones are available on this device. This is again our flagship phone. The next step up, I had mentioned auditorium sized rooms, multi-purpose rooms, things like that. I'm gonna go back to the room guide. We would consider this a multi-purpose room. What the 300 IPX allows you to do is tie into a PA interface box, which then ties into a mixer and an amplifier to, con to connect to your overhead speakers, your box speakers, 
your wireless mics, your handheld mics, your lapel mics. This device will allow you to bridge that VoIP call or that Zoom Teams WebEx call with that existing third-party equipment. Very popular solution for customers that already have overhead speakers, overhead mics, tabletop mics installed, but they wanna be able to do Zoom or Teams or WebEx. They can use the 300 IPX tied in with the PA interface box to connect back to the, to the mixer and the amplifier and give you that third-party solution um, to be able to connect to that existing equipment that you might already have in your office. This was a very, very popular solution before our next device came out, which is our CompTEL 800. This device is our most popular post-COVID device. Wired SIP, so it's hardwired to your phone system. It has an extension associated to it on your voice over IP platform. It has a USB port on it for video integration. If I want to use it with Zoom, Teams, WebEx, Google Meet, BlueJeans, any platform, I can use it with USB functionality, and it also has Bluetooth. This device has become our most popular solution for law firms, town halls, boardrooms, small collaboration spaces that want hybrid functionality so I can walk in there, dial out on my voice over IP platform, and also walk in and use my video enabled option, whether it's a laptop or an in-room PC to drive everything. What's Peter? Not, yes. Quick question. How popular are the PSTN devices? Scott asked. Yeah, those are, I mean, they're not trending down, but they're not trending up. A lot of our customers are really looking more for VoIP enabled devices versus the PSDN. Um, so we are seeing more of a push towards voice over IP or Bluetooth integrated only devices, cell phones, PCs, things of that nature. So there are still a number of customers out there that are that do have landlines and do have voice over IP phone systems, but it's not um, as prevalent as it, as it used to be. Gotcha. Thank you. CompTEL 800 is an expandable device. It does allow for smart microphone connectivity option if you want to increase the microphone pickup range. But where this device has really become popular is the daisy chaining functionality so what you can do is 1-800 will cover up to 20 people you can add a second 800 and do full duplex on both devices daisy chain together one is the primary unit the other becomes the secondary unit and will follow suit of whatever that primary unit is doing the two 800s are daisy chained together with a daisy chain cable they come in a 16 foot or 32 foot size it's the same in uh you actually get two cables you get them both um with the part number for the daisy chain cable but you can daisy chain two 800s together and cover a room of 30 to 40 people you can also add a third unit if you wanted to do so and this will follow suit of whatever connection you're doing whether it's wired sip over your voice over ip phone system usb to your pc or our one cable connection hub, or a Bluetooth integrated call with a lap with a laptop or a cell phone or anything along those lines. CompTEL 800, when you do three, you're covering anywhere from 50 to 60 people. One thing we've seen a lot of popularity on as well is modular rooms or multi-purpose rooms, as I had mentioned. Tables that can be moved that are on wheels. So what we've done, and we've seen a, a tremendous uptick for this solution, is we've started to build the CompTEL ceiling mount, which are now available to be able to put the CompTEL 800s in the ceiling for the customer. The benefit of this is you've removed the cabling. Now you can hide it in the ceiling and you don't have to worry if you do move the tables for any tripping hazards. The CompTEL 800 is designed to go into the ceiling. It is a UL certified bracket, so it is a safe bracket to put into the ceiling and hold the CompTEL 800 up. I always get the question, how do I control the CompTEL 800? There's two ways with USB functionality over a PC or a laptop, but we also have what's called our CompTEL Unite app, which allows you to use a tablet or a mobile device as the remote control to the CompTEL 800. I can dial out on this device. I can go into my calendar and initiate a call on my mobile device or my iPad, whatever I put in that room to control the 800 so I no longer have to climb on the table or climb on a chair to control the unit itself. With the IP address, you can get into the web interface or the GUI, 
for this device to upgrade the firmware, to change from daisy chain mode if you needed to do so, change the time or do anything along those lines um, with the IP address of the Confitil 800. Very, very popular solution that we've started to see a, a big uptick on is putting the 800s in the ceiling. We Peter? also have... Sorry, I'm going to just grab you for two more seconds. Yeah, we've got two yeah. questions. Yeah. Do these devices listen for and broadcast multicast traffic? So do these devices listen for and broadcast multicast traffic? So I think I understand where the what the question is. Um, if, if I'm wrong, please just update it in the uh, questions. But what our devices will allow you to do is connect multiple forms of connectivity options. For instance, if I'm on a SIP VoIP call and I'm on a USB call, I can bridge those calls together and bring them into one conference call. I believe that's the question he's asking, but I just want to make sure. He said, I'm also referring to multicast public address audio. I'll have to check on that one for you. I will have to check on that one for you, Jeffrey, and see if I can get that answer for you. Um, I know paging is not available on this device, but I will have to double check for you. Gotcha. Okay. The next question is Comptel looking to be supported by 3CX. I have templates for easy provisioning, uh, upgrades, et cetera. We are um, compatible with 3CX. Our support team is based out of Greenville, South Carolina. They will help you provision any device on 3CX, and then we can build some templates with that. We connect to Avaya, Cisco, Mitel, Shortel, uh, 3CX, you know, Ring Central. We don't have templates for every platform that we have connected to. However, we can put together some a, a templates for easier provisioning with the Comptel 800, the 300 WX IP, the 300 IPX, whatever a customer needs, we can always make it easier for them with that. Excellent. Just wanted to jump in on that, uh, Peter, just for example, um, our IT staff internally on the 888 VoIP side has been able to provision and configure a Comptel 800 in our conference room and it works very, very smoothly. You know, it wouldn't even know that it was, you know, a specific type of template. So uh, between the Comptel team and the 888 VoIP side, we should certainly be able to help with the 3CX integration, no problem. Perfect. The next uh, feature we're putting out in the Comptel 800 is the uh, lecture mode. And we've seen a lot of schools take advantage of this. And what that allows the teacher to do is wear a headset. And while that teacher is talking, they are able to uh, wear the headset. It will mute the entire 800 except for the microphone on the headset. So any background noise students misbehaving in the back talking, that microphone for the 800 is not going to pick that student up. The teacher will then have a microphone near their face so they will be able to walk around the classroom and ensure that they have the best possible microphone picking them up while they're in the classroom or maybe turning and facing a, a whiteboard or a Promethean board or something along those lines. So headset functionality for the 800 for lecture mode will be available in the next firmware update that we are going to be releasing. The next device I like to talk about is the Comptel Ego. This is uh, a half of the portion of the personal video kit that we're going to get a giveaway. This is a USB Bluetooth enabled speakerphone designed for up to six to eight people. It is travel friendly and I travel quite a bit. So I throw this in my book bag. I use it in the rental car, in the hotel room. I use it in the airport from time to time. I've also used it on the golf course. So very popular solution for anyone who works from home, for anyone who travels. If you have an executive office that you can shut a door in. I don't like to wear a headset. I don't like to be tied to my desk. So I use the Comptel Ego on a daily basis. It will charge over USB. And then when I leave to go on a trip, I'll unplug it, throw it in my book bag, and I'll use it on the road with me. Connected to my mobile device, so whenever I get a phone call, I will answer directly from the Ego. And then I also have it for USB, for Zoom calls and Teams calls and WebEx calls. I just sold a thousand of these into Zoll Medical, which is their pharmaceutical sales team. They needed it because they couldn't do anything 
remotely. Uh, in person, I'm sorry. They couldn't go into hospitals, so they had to do everything remotely. And they did, you know, they needed a better speaker and microphone than the laptop speaker and microphone that's built into a PC. It's just not designed for video conferencing. So 360 degree microphone on the Comptel Ego, USB plug and play, also Bluetooth connected. The bigger brother is the Comptel 70, designed for up to 15 people. Same connectivity options as the Ego, it's USB and Bluetooth, just not as travel friendly. It is going to be a little bit bigger, so it's designed for uh, more users, really designed for smaller to medium-sized collaboration spaces. This device has become popular because a lot of customers have gotten rid of their conference phones. A lot of customers, or, or I'm sorry, their, their desk phones and their phone systems, and they're using USB or Bluetooth integrated devices. And that's where the 70 comes into play. Um, you don't want to have a phone number associated to this device, or you have a video-only solution room. That's where the Comptel 70 has been uh, a, a very popular solution. Peter, we have another question. We have three camera. Yep, go ahead. Oh, okay, we've got uh, Charles asked, what type of USB do these devices have? Standard USB, so the, the, the Comptel Ego, the Comptel 70 is USB micro, the Comptel 800 is USB micro, the 300WX is USB mini. Um, but it's USB A. However, we are uh, we do work on USB C with an adapter if needed. Okay, we've got one more um, question regarding the NetSapien support for the IP phones. I will have to confirm with my support team on that one. I believe we are compatible with NetSapiens. Typically, the rule of thumb is as long as you can put a generic SIP endpoint license or a third party license on your phone system, you are able to provision our devices onto that. There is, uh, if you look at Avaya, if you have version version 11 or below, it they don't allow for third party SIP endpoint licenses. Um, 8x8, for instance, they will not give us the provision instructions. However, if we call them or the customer calls them, they will provision our devices for their network. But there is, you know, Cisco Skinny is one that doesn't allow for third-party SIP endpoint licenses. Um, so I can get you that answer for sure um, after the webinar when I talk to our support team. Okay, we got two, one more question. Also, is there a web management and provisioning platform to manage all the devices? We do have zero touch installation to push out any um, provisioning needed for our devices. However, we do not have a management tool as of yet that you can go in and, and look at all the devices on the network. Thank you. We have three cameras in our portfolio. These are USB plug and play cameras. So they work with every platform, again, Zoom, Teams, WebEx, et cetera. Um, the first camera is a personal webcam, business webcam, 1080p, full HD. It's a USB plug and play camera. 4X digital zoom, 90 degree field of view. It does have a built-in privacy shutter. So you are able to uh, you know, shut that off if you're not streaming and you don't want you know, Facebook or anyone looking in on you. Um, does have a couple microphones built in and it also uh, does come with a software controller. So you can change a number of the settings if you wanna change the brightness, the sharpness, the contrast, you can do so with our software controller. Personal webcam design, you know, one to two people in a, in a, in a cubicle type space. The Comptel Cam 20 is our small to medium sized conference room camera, USB Ultra HD 4K image, does come with a remote control. It has an 8X digital zoom. I'll give you a quick demo in a second um, once I stop sharing my screen and you'll be able to see the camera and uh, get an idea of the 123 degree field of view camera. But all of our cameras, again, do come with a remote control. Preset functionality does come uh, available on both the Cam 20 and the Cam 50. And this one also has a microphone. If you wanted to enable the microphone on the Cam 20, works about eight to 10 feet away from the device, from the customer. The bigger boardroom camera, medium to, to extra large conference room, is our full PTZ camera, 12X optical zoom, 72.5 degree field of view, again, USB plug and play, remote control included. Um, full HD, 
camera. This is our most popular camera just because a lot of customers like that flexibility to really move about the office. And the 12X optical zoom will give them a nice clean image when they are zooming in on a whiteboard or having a preset set um, to go to you know different locations that are needed. The last thing that we have in regards to making it easy for the conference room and making it easy for the employees to be able to conduct any video meetings is we've developed what's called our one cable connection hub, which is a little four port box. So you've got TV or projector, HDMI into the box, USB camera, the cam 20 or the cam 50 into the one cable connection box. USB audio device. So all of the audio devices I showed you, the Ego, the 70, the 800, the 300 series, USB into the box. Then you have your laptop. So I walk in, I have a meeting at 11.30, I set my computer down, I plug in a single USB cable, everything is now paired. My audio is paired, my camera's paired and ready to go, and my screen's ready to go for screen sharing purposes. I unplug, Liz has a meeting at two o'clock. She walks in with her laptop. She plugs in the USB connection. Cameras paired, audio's paired, screens ready to go for screen sharing purposes. Just makes every room the same, every room easy to deploy these solutions. So you're not calling IT, how do I connect the audio? How, how do I connect the camera? How do I share my screen? All of that's done for you with our one cable connection hub. That's the first type of conference room that we've seen is the BYOD solution where what we've done is we've kitted all of this stuff together and that's available at 888 Boy. You get the audio device, you get the camera, you get the hub, two year warranty over the full portfolio, one box, one SKU, one throat to choke, so to speak, with our kits. And we have a number of different kits depending on the size of the room, the number of people. So again, we can outfit your solution with whatever your customer's needs are. Make mention of the uh, bottom three uh, in the bottom row. Those are our hybrid kits. Those are our most popular because it gives you the flexibility to tie into the voice over IP or analog phone system and the video solution. So now I can use one conference phone for an audio solution and that same conference phone for my video solution. So I don't have to have two on the desk. I can have audio only calling and video enabled solutions with those two kit with those three kits you see down there along the bottom. The other side of the coin, so the BYOD is I'm bringing in a laptop every time I'm driving a meeting. The other side of the coin is the in-room PC setup, which <laughs> you can use any type of Intel Nook, Dell Optiplex, Acer Chromebox, whatever you wanna do, we'll just piggyback off of that in-room PC and it removes our hub so to speak. HDMI from the screen into the PC, USB camera into the PC, USB audio device into the PC, or we can open up the door with Bluetooth integrated devices like the Ego, the 70, the Comftel 800. <clears throat> so you have that flexibility to do so with an in-room PC setup. We've also designed our in-room PCs to work with a USB controller. So if you want to tie that into an MTR room or a Zoom room or anything along those lines, you can do so. And in the kits that we've created, just give you longer cables for extension purposes, whether it's a, a longer cable for the 800 or a longer cable for the camera, we do have that flexibility to drive that um, with our in-room PC kits. Can I questions? pause your? Yeah, yep, yep. I got a few. Right. So, first was product availability across the presentation portfolio. How does Comptel's product availability look like? Yeah, that's a great question. We actually have um, plenty of product readily available right now for all of our customers. Um, obviously, a big, big opportunity could come and wipe us out for about a week, but I don't know what our order management team has done in regards to this whole COVID era. They, uh, we have plenty of product readily available right now to ship by the end of the day if you had a, an immediate need for your customers. Okay, are there mounts for the PTZ camera? Another good question. All of our cameras have a quarter inch thread drilled into the bottom of them for tripod access, ceiling mount access, wall mount access. The Cam 50, specifically the PTZ camera, does ship with a wall mount available. It's um, shipped inside the cam 50 box 
However, there are other mounts available. If you were to look on Amazon or 888 VoIP, they might have some ancillary accessories uh, like ceiling mounts, wall mounts that they can recommend for a quarter inch thread um, device. However, the CAM50 is shipped with a wall mount for the, for the wall. Okay. Uh, does it have auto fo focus on the person talking, auto centering on attendees? The CAM20 does have auto framing. Uh, the CAM50 does not. And what we found in big boardrooms when customers are talking on both ends of the table, it feels like a ping pong match. So we don't have the auto focus or the, or the um, auto talking functionality built in. However, I will show you how CompTEL handles that with our preset functionality. Okay, and last, is there a PC less Zoom kit? The CompTEL 800, the CompTEL Cam 20, and soon enough, the CompTEL Cam 50. So the 800 and the 20 specifically are Zoom certified right now um, on the SIP side of things. However, if you are doing video conferencing, you do need to uh, have a PC enabled to drive the Zoom call. Okay, and if you ceiling, um, hang on a second, if your ceiling mount, oh, can you rotate the picture? If you're using a ceiling mount on one of these, can you rotate the picture? Yes, another great question. You are able to get into the menu settings of both the CAM 20 and the CAM 50 and invert the image if you need to. You can mirror the image. You can change a number of the settings on the camera, whether it's the, the sharpness, the, the, the backlight, it will auto focus you can rotate or flip the image or the picture. Awesome, thank you. Absolutely, we do have some promotions and tools available. The first promotion is a deal registration. If you have an opportunity of 10,000 MSRP, you get a 10% discount. That will be passed through. Um, we just need the end user information, SKU list of what you're looking at doing and we will protect you with that 10% discount. If someone else comes to us, like a, like a CDW for instance, and wants to register a deal that you have worked and already registered, that 10% won't go to CDW. That will be protected to the partner that brings us into the opportunity. Our number one promotion is our 30 day try and buy return policy. We do accept back open box returns, no questions asked, no risk. You can test, evaluate, benchmark our equipment, if they're unhappy with it for any reason, they can send it back nine and a half out of 10 times. They are pleased, they are happy. It sounds good, it looks good. They don't return it. We do have public sector pricing available, which is a 5% sled discount for government, healthcare, education, non-for-profit. And if anyone's interested in some NFR equipment, we do have NFR program, 60% off on the audio, 50% off on the video solutions to give you some NFR equipment. We can work with you on that. Just talk to your 888 VoIP rep and uh, we can get you that NFR pricing if needed. One thing I wanna show is I do have a number of case studies that I have talked to a number of different customers about. So we have talked about an in-room PC setup. Um, this is a, a law firm in New York. They actually have the CAM 20 inverted upside down with the in-room PC behind the TV there, the CompTEL 800 is connected to that PC via Bluetooth. So they can walk in, they can dial out on their Cisco call manager platform, but they can also walk in and do start a video call with the in-room PC that they have in that solution. So we have a number of different case studies that we're able to share with your customer based on their room size, number of people, and what they're really trying to do. The biggest thing about Comptel is we are agnostic. So we work with every single platform. So whatever platform your customer wants to bring, that's okay. We can utilize our solution, our hardware, so they're not handcuffed into a certified Teams room only, where you can only use Microsoft Teams or only use Zoom in a, in a certain room. Um, we have, and I wanted to show the ceiling install because it has become a very, very popular solution. Um, that is the business committee on the left uh, in New Jersey right there. They have three CompTEL 800s put into the ceiling. One is right next to an air conditioning fan just to go to show you how well our filtering works on our device. They have zero issues with this. This has been installed for about a year and a half now. Um, three CompTEL 800s we, in the ceiling. 
Yep. Sorry, Peter. I don't think we can yeah. see your screen. Oh, I don't oh, know that's... if you're sharing. Sorry. Yep. I forgot it was on my Zoom thing. Let me go back. Here we go. Clean. Go. Oops. Let me go back. I'll go back to the beginning. Um, this was the law firm that I was talking about. Are you, you're seeing it now, right? Yep, we're good. Okay. Um, this was the law firm I was talking about. Cam 20s inverted underneath uh, USB going into the PC, Constell 800, Bluetooth connected to the to the uh, in-room PC there, connected to their phone system as well as their video-enabled room. So they have the flexibility to do both. Um, any size room, any number of people, we have solutions that can outfit whatever your customer is trying to do. So there you can see kind of the same idea, the Comptel 800 sitting on the desk, Cam 50 with the wall mount included uh, beneath that TV there, that is the PTZ camera. Um, again, I wanted to show the ceiling mounts just to give you an idea. The, the picture on the left is the uh, business committee. That 800 is right next to the air conditioning fan that does filter out that background noise. So this does give you an idea of kind of the different rooms that we've put the ceiling mounts into um, with the Comptel 800. It has become a very, very popular solution that we have to offer. Um, schools, schools were, were huge in 2020, 2021 for anyone who had to go through remote learning. We outfit a number of classrooms with our cameras, with our audio devices, with our hubs. Um, you can see here the camera in the middle of the uh, ceiling. Audio device, he's about 13 feet away to give you an idea of how that pickup range works on that microphone that he has um, that they purchased. Secondary monitor so he can see all his students and then he's driving everything off the Promethean board. Um, last one I'll show you, and this is a very busy picture, but this is the um, third-party equipment solution. The 300 IPX is in the middle of that cork board right there. PA interface box is tied into the mixer and the amplifier. This customer has two handheld mics plus um, four big box speakers for his warehouse to conduct his meetings in there. Um, I'm gonna pass it back over to Joe now. Uh, Liz, I, I don't know, are there any other questions before, actually I should, Ask yep. if there's questions before I pass it over to Joe. Yeah, we got a few. Um, is there specific brand integration? So does the system integrate with multi-brand supported equipment like a PBX, Sealing phones, or other audio brands when you want to connect other devices? As long as you can have that third-party SIP endpoint license, yes. Um, we have we have some partnerships with ScreenBeam, with Barco. We have some partnerships. Uh, we're working on a partnership with Sangoma right now. Um, we are certified on Avaya. We are certified on Cisco. So we do have a number of um, solutions that we can partner with, yes. Okay. Um, and then we've got, how does the camera react to LED lighting? That's gonna be based in the settings. So there's a number of different types of lights out there, obviously. So when, when you have LED lighting, there is you know different settings that you can go in and manage and um, adjust the brightness or the, the, the backlighting or anything along those lines that you may need to do. Gotcha. And then last question is, do you guys offer partnership levels? That's uh, done on a case-by-case -case basis. It's definitely something we can look into. We don't have a partner program per se, um, but if there are any requests, we can always look on helping with marketing opportunities or anything along those lines. On our website, on comptel.com, if you were, I'm sh sharing my screen right, yep. Yeah. Um, if you were to scroll all the way to the bottom and go under our marketing resources page, here you can find a number of different things that you can co-brand with Comptel and your company. So um, the room guide is there, pre-made e-shots are available there, our climate neutral statement is there, our web in images are there, our data sheets are available. However, if there is a partnership program you wanna look at, we can definitely look at doing something along those lines. Okay, I think that's all I have. Uh, I actually had one question sent to me, Peter. Maybe um, we could just clarify. It was more from a setup perspective. So 
question really was more along the lines of trying to hide, you know, the cords as best as possible. So this setup uh, scenario was, you know, with Bluetooth connection for the audio and video to the Nook itself and having mm -hmm. the Nook mounted behind the display, would that help to kind of eliminate or result in less cords being, a, 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 you know, appearing out um, on the setup itself, you know, being that the Bluetooth and audio are all, you know, tied into the nook behind the display? Yes, absolutely. Um, that's, that's a lot of these opportunities that you're seeing. These rooms were designed for audio conferencing and they never put a conduit or piping under the flooring. So a lot of these customers are utilizing Bluetooth integrated devices. Now they still have to control and power the 800. Um, which is a PoE enabled device, but a lot of these tables will have power already associated to that, or they'll have a network jack below the table, but there's no way getting back to the TV. So Bluetooth does clean up the wiring quite a bit because the camera is gonna go USB directly into the PC, that cable is hidden, HDMI from the TV to the PC, that's gonna be hidden, and then you have it wirelessly connecting with the Comptel 800 to that in-room PC. The oh. Comptel 70 I mentioned is USB and Bluetooth. They have a PC in this scenario. They have actually removed their phone systems. They're going to be getting rid of that, that uh, Cat5 cable that's popping out and just use the Comptel 70 as a wireless USB and Bluetooth enabled solution for the in-room PC that they have in there. They do USB to charge, charge the PC, of course. Charge the Comptel 70, I'm sorry. All right, if anyone has any additional questions, you want to pop them in your in the question box, you're welcome to. Um, and I guess we'll pass it back to Joe. Yeah, no, thank you so much, Peter, for going over everything. Um, you know, I personally learned a few new things here every time, you know, we kind of get together. So I appreciate all that. Um, like Liz had mentioned, if there's other questions, obviously we will hang out for a couple minutes to answer those, but um, feel free to reach out to me directly. My email is up on the screen here. Obviously, Peter is always available as well. Um, and the whole staff here at 888 Boy, we want to try to help out as much as possible. Um, after the webinar is over, uh, we do have those four giveaways. So we'll make sure to go through and contact the winners directly and see what we can do to get those out to you. Um, but yeah, just uh, wrapping up really quick, just want to make sure anything you need from a Comptel perspective, you don't have just you know one point of contact. There's a full team at 888. You've got Peter and his team as well. Feel free to contact us directly. We can get you know anything initiated for, from a meeting perspective and uh, see what we can do on availabilities. But uh, we really do appreciate everyone's time today. It was uh, a very great turnout, great webinar. So we're looking forward to talking with you all more and seeing what we can do to get some Comptel units uh, on on proposals in the near future. Uh, we've got one last question, and is are there rebates available? We typically do rebates through the distribution level, so 888-VOIP. Um, however, there are opportunities if you're looking at bringing in stock for yourself oh, to, to get a discount uh, through 888-VOIP if you are looking at um, bringing in stock for, for your own quick shipping opportunities or anything along those lines. So there are rebates available, just get with your 888 VoIP rep and then they can touch base with me and we can work on, you know, what you're looking for idea-wise in regards to stock or anything along those lines. Not to put you on the spot, Peter, but is there any sort of like MOQ or anything like that? If you were to take a stocking position, um, you know, to, to kind of get the most out of that discount percentage? Yeah, typically, don't hold me to it. Let's, I mean, I would say maybe anywhere from 20 to 25 units. If you're looking at bringing in some inventory, absolutely, we can do a discount. Okay. There's one other one, demo unit pricing. Demo unit is 50% off on the audio solution and then six, uh, on the video solution, 60% off on the audio solutions. I'll share PDF with Liz and the 888 VoIP team, and they will then share it with everybody um, in regards to your demo unit pricing. Thank you. And that demo is off of MSRP. All right. Well, thank you all again. Um, 
yeah, I don't, uh, I don't think there's any other questions, but we're always here to jump in to support you with anything you need. So feel free to reach out. Thank you all again for attending. Thank you so much, Peter, for that presentation. Um, and thank you, 8 to 8 marketing team for putting this all together. I really appreciate it. Absolutely. I think one more did just come in. Um, yes, yeah. absolutely. We can look at um, an MDF program. If that's something we want to jump on a call with and, and talk about how to reach out to your customer base um, with some co-branded material, we do have that available on our website. We can work with our marketing team to be able to put your logo on our images or on our data sheets. I know I've done that with a, a couple of people on the call already that, that we've chatted with. Um, but yeah, absolutely. We can look at some MDF opportunities. Yeah, one more. How about certified partner programs? Right now, that is something that we're in talks with in regards to going to like a premium partner program. I would love to jump on a call with anyone who's interested in potentially looking at a certified partner program and, and just kind of get to know the business and see what we can do together and try to figure out the best possible opportunities to make these uh, premium partner programs work successfully. Outstanding. I think we're done. Perfect. Thank you, everybody, for joining. Yeah, thank you again. Have a great day, everybody.